Welcome to our tutorial about the corner round and corner chamfer tools. Let's start with the corner chamfer tool. Our three chamfer creation methods are one distance, distance and angle, and two distances. Let's use one distance and select the corner to chamfer. Next, we set the chamfer distance value. Let's say 2 millimeters. Click OK. Let's undo that chamfer and activate the corner chamfer tool again. The next option is distance and angle. First, we select the edge. Then we select the corner to chamfer. Let's change the angle value. Let's say 60 degrees. As you see, the distance value relates to the edge we selected. With this chamfer creation type, I can only select one corner. If I try to select another corner, then the corner I selected first becomes deselected. Let's click OK. And let's undo that corner chamfer and activate the tool again. Let's check out the last option, two distances. First we select the corner. Here we can flip to change the direction if we need to. Once again, if I try to select two corners at a time, I'm not able to. Let's click OK. And let's undo that corner chamfer. Now let's check out the corner round tool. First we select the corners. Then we establish the radius value, let's say 2 millimeters. Let's add a couple more corners. And this one here, we'll set the radius to 3 millimeters. Click OK. To edit this feature, just double click. If I want to unselect a corner, press Ctrl and then select it. This will deselect the corners. Let's click OK. Now let's right click and delete the corner round feature. I'm going to add a couple flanges. Let's make them 7 millimeters in height. And click OK. Let's activate the corner round again. We've already used the corner mode. Let's try the feature mode now. Click this radio button. Let's change the radius value to 2 millimeters. Let's select our two flanges, change the radius value to 3 millimeters, and click OK. And this concludes our tutorial about the corner round and corner chamfer tools. We'll be covering a couple more corner treatments in our next two chapters, the corner rip and the corner seam.